Good morning. Good morning. Brother Alex is uh, finishing up the uh, school mass. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and start, and hopefully he'll be able to join us at the end. If not, then um, well, we'll, go ahead. We'll, we'll, continue, we'll just continue to go and whatever. So, oh God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Hallelujah. Yeah. Hold on a second. Mine didn't update, so no, there we go. I still had Catherine. Mm. Let's do all the antiphons. You go to the hymn of Pepe. I'm trying to see what the hymn is, but first I have to bit, be in the right place. I still had yesterday's. Mm. I thought I updated, but I didn't. And we have the same song that we sang so many times. Jesus Christ is risen today. Well, that's okay. Mm -hmm. They know it, and I know it, and you know they it. Did. So that's that's what the good part about it. Mm -hmm. So the many stands as we can sing to, I think. Oh okay, yeah. So. We can sing the first and the, the last. Okay. okay. Jesus Christ is risen today. Hallelujah. Our triumphant holy day. Hallelujah. Who did once upon the cross. City of God, you. That's right. O City of God, you are the source of our life. With music and dance, we shall rejoice in you. Alleluia. On the holy mountain is this city, cherished by the Lord. The Lord prefers the gates of Zion to all of Jacob's dwellings. Of you are told glorious things, O City of God. Babylon and Egypt, I will count among those who know me. Philistia, Tyre, and Ethiopia, these will be her children, and Zion shall be called the mother, for all shall be her children. It is he, the Lord Most High, who gives each his place. In his register of peoples, he writes, These are her children, and while they dance, they will sing, and you all find their home. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Hallelujah. City of God, you are the source of our life. With music and dance, we shall rejoice in you. Alleluia. Let us pray. Lord God, your only Son wept over ancient Jerusalem, soon to be destroyed for its lack of faith. He established the new Jerusalem firmly upon rock and made it the mother of the faithful. Make us rejoice in your church and grant that all people may be reborn into the freedom of your spirit. Like a shepherd, he will gather the lambs in his arms and carry them close to his heart. Alleluia. Here comes with power the Lord God, who rules by his strong arm. Here is his reward with him. He is recompensed, recompensed before him. Like a shepherd, he feeds his flock. In his arms, he gathers the lambs. 
carrying them in his bosom and leading the ewe with care. He has cupped in his hand, he has cupped in his hand the waters of the sea and marked off the heavens with a span, who has held in a measure the dust of the earth, weighed the mountains in scales and the hills in a balance. He who has, go ahead. Who has directed the spirit of the Lord or has instructed him as his counselor? Whom did he consult to gain knowledge? Who taught him the path of judgment? Or showing him the way of understanding? Behold, the nations count as a drop of the bucket, as rust on the scales. The coastlands weigh no more than powder. Lebanon would not suffice for quill, nor its animals be enough for holocausts. Before him all the nations are as naught, as nothing, and void he counts them. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was at the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Amen. Like, like a shepherd, shepherd he will gather the lambs in his arms, and carry, and carry them, them close, close to his, his heart. heart. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Great is the Lord in Zion. He is exalted above all the peoples. Hallelujah. The Lord is king. The peoples tremble. He is throned on the cherubim. The earth quakes. The Lord is great in Zion. He is supreme over all the peoples. Let them praise his name, so terrible and great. He is holy, full of power. You are a king who loves what is right. You have established equity, justice, and right. You have established them in Jacob. Exalt the Lord our God. Bow down before Zion, his footstool. He, the Lord, is holy. Among his priests were Aaron and Moses. Among those who invoked his name was Samuel. They invoked the Lord, and he answered. To them he spoke in the pillar of cloud. They did his will. They kept the law, which he, the Lord, had given. O Lord our God, you answered them. For them you were a God who forgives, yet you punished all their offenses. Exalt the Lord our God. Bow down before his holy mountain, for the Lord our God is holy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Great, Great is, is the Lord, Lord in Zion. Zion. He is he exalted, exalted above all, all the peoples. peoples. Alleluia. Let us pray. God, you are the source of all holiness. Though no one can see you and live, you, you give life most generously, and in an e even greater way, restore it. Sanctify your priest through your life-giving word, and consecrate your people in his blood until our eyes see your face. A reading from the letter of St. Paul to Romans. If Christ is in you, the body is dead because of sin. While the Spirit lives because of justice, if the Spirit of him who raised Jesus from the dead dwells in you, then he who raised Christ from the dead will bring you mortal bodies to life also through his Spirit dwelling in you. The Word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. The Lord is risen from the tomb. Alleluia, alleluia. The Lord is risen from the tomb. Alleluia, alleluia. He, he hung upon the cross for us. Alleluia, alleluia. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. The Lord is risen from the tomb. Alleluia. Amen, amen, I say to you, whoever believes in me will live forever. Alleluia. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has come to his people and set us free. He has raised up for us a mighty Savior, born of the house of his servant David, through his holy prophets he promised of old that he would save us from our enemies, from the hands of all who hate us. He promised to show mercy to our fathers and to remember his holy covenant. This was the oath he swore to our father Abraham, to keep us free from the hands of our enemies, free to worship him without fear, holy and righteous in his sight, all the days of our life. You, my child, shall be called the prophet of the Most High, for you will go before the Lord to prepare his way, to give his people knowledge of salvation by the forgiveness of their sins, 
the tender the compassion of our God, the dawn from on high shall break upon us, to shine on those who dwell in darkness and the shadow of death, and to guide our feet into the way of peace. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Amen, amen, I say to you, whoever believes in me will live forever. Alleluia. Christ rose from the dead and is always present in his church. Let us adore him and say, Stay with, with us, Lord. Lord Jesus, victor over sin and death, glorious and immortal, be always in our midst. Come to us in the power of your victory and, sh and show our, our hearts the loving kindness of your Father. Come to heal a world wounded by division. For you alone can transform our hearts and make them one. Strengthen our faith in final victory. And renew our hope in the second coming. We pray, uh, continue to pray for our own church as we uh, prepare in the next few weeks to, to open the church to, to all the peoples uh, in a step-by-step -step fashion uh, that has yet been revealed to us. But when that time comes, may we rejoice in the Lord and may we uh, once again renew old friendships and uh, celebrate what God has done for us, we pray. Stay, Stay with us, Lord. Lord. We pray for our church leaders, for our Pope Francis, our Bishop Paul, and all the bishops, that they may be guided by the Holy Spirit to take the right decisions in this time, to help us grow in our faith. We pray to the Lord. Stay with us, Lord. And for all who continue to, to heal from the coronavirus, for all those we have lost, and certainly for all the people who have worked in the hospitals and, and various care units. Um, may they be blessed for the gift that they have been to so many. And for those we have lost, may they find their way to your heavenly home, we pray. Stay, Stay with us, Lord. Lord. And for your prayers at this time. We pray. Stay, Stay with, with us, Lord. Lord. Now let's join all these prayers in the one prayer our Savior gave us as we pray. Our, our Father, who art, art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Let us pray. Father, in this holy season, we come to know the full depth of your love. You have freed us from the darkness of error and sin. Help us to cling to your truths with fidelity. We ask this, O our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Amen. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. May every blessing of Almighty God, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit come upon you and remain with you forever and ever. Amen. Amen. Go in peace. Thanks, Thanks be to God. Be to God. It's going to be hot outside today, so uh, I'm going to be prepared for that. Uh, take a hat. <laughs> if you find one of my hats, you can use that until I, it makes my way back to me, because I always leave them around. <laughs> but uh, enjoy the day, and I hope you have an opportunity to get together with, with family soon. God bless you. Have a nice day.